We never said the questions would be easy questions. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, it's a good question. Uh, we subsidize because there are, to make it short, we subsidize because we didn't want to raise uh, salaries, and that was a mistake. Uh, I think with what Mr. Obama is doing, I don't envy him on the heavy thing on his shoulder that he inherited. But uh, so socialism is really much deeper than that. This is just bailing out some industry, and we would do the same thing in my country to, uh, to get, get to a better uh, uh, end. Uh, so I, I think he, I hope he's, he, he will succeed, but I think he's doing the right thing. So you don't see your own country as socialism? No. No, we, 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 like I said, simply, we, we did that, but we did it wrong. And therefore, it looks like a social, uh, social system. Uh, we are far away from so, uh, social system. And, and like I said, social system has much more deeper uh, issues than, than what we're doing right now. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, yes, in front. And if you'd please introduce yourself. Yeah, thank you. I'm uh, Lila Katifandri Hamman, and I'm the ambassador of the African Union here. I would like to thank first uh, the ambassador of uh, Arabia Saudia for the inform very informative uh, briefing. Uh, I have a very simple question. Uh, just I want to know what is the level of trade exchange between uh, so, uh, Saudi Arabia and Africa, essentially. Uh, Sub-Saharan uh, countries in Africa. Thank what is you. the what? Uh, the, the exchange oh. between Saudi Arabia and, and some uh, of the African Sub-Saharan uh, countries Sub in Africa. Africa. The trade. The trade. They're getting tougher. These questions. I don't know. Oh, you, you have no <laughs> idea what these people are capable of. Uh, we we have. Uh, we have, I'm not privy to the information of the particular trades between Saudi Arabia and, uh, and uh, uh, Sub-Sahara, we said, Sub-Sahara uh, areas. But we do have agricultural, believe it or not, agricultural trade. And we are, we're, because of the, uh, uh, because of the, uh, the limitation of water resources in the kingdom, we're, we're, uh, we're looking somewhere else where we can invest ourselves and, uh, and, and, and uh, be with that country. But I'm not, uh, I'm sorry, I don't know exactly the intricate of the, uh, of the trade between the... Can I ask a supplementary there? Because this right. is very interesting. You are short of water because you don't have water. So you are intending to import water from other countries by really no. importing the products of water, which is livestock and grain right. and uh, agricultural products, right. which is ultimately right. water. We're, we're, we're partnering in Sudan, for instance, and uh, other uh, uh, African nations with to, to see where the water resources are high. To do, we, we built, we, we finance 100% the, the agricultural and, and livestock and the dairy uh, product in that country. To, to pay for it, to you know, to pay for it ourselves later on and buy it from that country. Uh, yes, uh, on the aisle on the left here. The, the first question is, uh, we really do have a lot of uh, uh, people who, 
who are much more educated than I am. The, the issue is not that. The issue is uh, in every country there is a, 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 a way or a system, be it monarchy or be it uh, state-run business like a republic and things like that. Now, we have seen uh, in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia a family, we treat them like the British treat the, uh, the queen in, the, in there, and we, we do more because they run the country right. They are uh, uh, abdicating or giving the, uh, the power to, uh, to the people now. We have a, a parliamentary se uh, group that is becoming very powerful right now. Uh, the king is trying to uh, push away this family business and we have if you look at the hierarchy and the new who becomes king you will see that that not because you are the oldest you're going to become king no more you have to be qualified first of all and that's something we haven't you know seen now why do we really support a system like that you look around us except for our own crazy people who became to start throwing at us uh, bombs and things as terrorists we really are in a very safe uh, country. And uh, the, we, the, the people respect the system, and the system respect the people. So it's not really, and I'm not, I'm not talking about just uh, my level of people, or uh, my level of, uh, 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 as, a, as an ambassador, but I'm, I'm talking about all level. I did start as a young engineer, uh, struggling with, uh, with my wife and trying to make money. Uh, and I felt the same way as I feel today about the system. Now, the second, uh, the second question was about the human rights, and especially for women. Uh, I cannot uh, uh, defend a lot of things that happens in, uh, in my country. Again, that shows if we can, the, this king can go and just sweep all of these guys as we call them, you know, the tough guys and things, and get rid of it. He let them speak, he let us speak. The, 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 he lets the, the ultra-conservative speak, and he let the liberal speak. And he would like to have a, a, an opinion change, if, or he forced the opinion to change. And you will see, and I agree with you, maybe we're not moving as fast as we should, but we will in the future. You'll see difference in the... Uh, human right, treatment of, uh, of labors, treatment of uh, women, all of this. If what, what I just want to add one more thing. What, ha what have done, what have changed Europe for years, decades, and hundreds of years, we're doing it within the last 30 or so years, and it's going to be even faster to change, I hope. Uh, we, we have many other people who would like to ask questions. Thank you. Uh, third from the aisle on the right side, please. Um, I was one earlier to say that um, the oil that uh, Saudi Arabia produces, although finite, has made the country rich. I was wondering how is it uh, distributed? Like, is there a lot of poverty in the country or no? Um, just, in, just because, like, I would think for the royal family. Yeah, we don't, we don't, uh, we produce and sell uh, on the average about 9 million barrels a day. That's a lot of oil and lots of money. But we don't go and say, okay, let's spread that on a daily basis for the, for the people. We do have poverty, uh, something we should have de dealt with a long time ago. But in the last five years, we start building housing and things and, and getting some of that wealth to the, to the unfortunate people there. And uh, we, uh, we have a lot of programs that gear towards the thing, but we don't want to subsidize again. Subsidy is not a good system to take care of. We want to increase the per capita income, the income of, uh, of the people uh, when they work. But I'm told that the government